Hey there! In today's physics exercise, I will try to solve a fun physics test. It is for approximately 7th grade and it is based on the uh, physics tree. Uh, this is uh, something that I was playing previously. I will go back here now uh, on the test and let's begin it. Have to <clears throat> what I have to choose one of the three answers on the question which is right here. Okay, choose the right statement. This is about magnetism. Magnetism is the study of attraction. Magnetism is the study of electric currents, currents, or magnetism is the study of light refraction. Well, this is too simple, this is not it, maybe it is the second answer. Alright, and I can see if the answer is correct. The next one is part of the electricity. Choose the right statement. Electricity is motion of molecules. Electricity is motion of electrons. Or electricity is motion of protons. Well, this is the second one again. Correct. Okay, question three. Choose the right statement again. And this is about electrostatics. So, electrostatics deals with low moving electric charges. Low, slow moving. <laughs> electrostatic deals with fast moving electric charges. Or electrostatics deals with high gravity electric charges. I don't think gravity is involved here. Maybe one of these two. Maybe the first one. Huh? Yes. Right. Uh, ooh. <laughs> this is not my final mark, so nothing to worry about. Uh, what is the next field? The electronics. Electronics is the science of magnetic fields. Electronics is the science of the nucleus or electronics is the science of controlling electrical energy. I think it's the last one. Yep. Okay, next question. Which of the following is a force? Mm. This is about forces. Uh, I have bugs. Actually, it's an, a wasp. <laughs> okay, infinity. Infinity is not a force. Accuracy is not a force, and this is simple. Gravity is a force. Next question. Uh, gravity is a natural phenomen, phenomen, phenomenon by which all things with mass are brought toward one another. Gravity. All things with mass bounce at each other. All things have the same masses. Well, when uh, gravity is given, all things are with the same masses, but Right, so I have one mistake. Sadly, I cannot go back to fix it. But uh, this is why it is a test. <sighs> Next question. Choose the right statement. Mechanics is the study of communicating vessels. Nope. Mechanics is the study of the motion of light refraction. And mechanics is the study of the motion of bodies in frame of reference. That should be the last one. Uh, the next question, choose the right statement. This is about thermodynamics. Thermodynamics is connected with sound and sound waves. Nope. Thermodynamics is connected with light and speed. And thermodynamics is connected with heat and temperature. So this should be the correct answer. 
Question number 9. Which of the following refers to fluid dynamics? Actually, what I know is that everything is fluid dynamics, even gases. But let's see Brownian motion, communicating vessels, and low energy. Among all these three, I think it is the communicating vessels. Yep, it, they are not science vessels from StarCraft 2. <laughs> okay, question number 9. Uh, 10, sorry. Which of the following is only a wave? Gravity is not a wave. Light uh, can be seen as wave and particle, and the answer should be sound. Question 11. Choose the right statement. Optics. Uh -huh. Opt optic optics is the study of the physical properties of light. That sound sounds plausible. 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 Optics is the study of sound and sound wave. Nope. And optics is the study of sunglasses. Hmm. Okay, the first one. Now, acoustics. Again, I have to choose the right statement. Acoustics is the study of music. Hmm. Acoustics is the study of sound and sound waves. And acoustic is the study of big spaces. Uh, okay, the second one. Uh, okay, when we vibrating, forces are centrifugal. When vibrating, oscillations occur about an equilibrium point. Or objects change masses. Well, they don't change masses. Uh, they are not centrifugal, so it should be the the second answer. Correct. Well, now I'm, I'm almost for B. Let me see if I can reach A. Which of the following refers to nuclear physics? Fission and fusion, motion and oscillation, reflection and refraction. Well, fission and fusion. Of course, uh, this is uh, about nuclear physics. Boom. Disgusting. Well, but it gives energy a lot. Uh, question number 15. Which of the following is a nanotechnology? A giant robot, artificial intelligence, or miniature? Miniature robot. Miniature. Mini <laughs> miniature. Uh, well, this is the one, the third one, because it is nanotechnology. Ooh, quantum mechanics is applied to a small scale scales and low energy levels of subatomic subatomic particles. Mm, well, I, I think this is the answer, but let's see the other. A large scale and high energy levels of atomic particles and both of the above, but I think the quantum mechanics is about small things. Correct. All right, now. If you light a lamp in moving in a moving plane, the speed of light will be equal to the speed of light plus the speed of the plane. Only the speed of light and the speed of light minus the speed of the plane. Okay, so we have a speed of plane of the plane. We light uh, the flash and the speed of light begins to travel with the speed of plane, but the, the speed of light is uh, ultimate, so there is no <laughs> more, at least uh, for the physics in the year 2022. Maybe in the future we can... Uh, also, if we find a faster speed of the light, it should, shouldn't be in our universe, uh, according to our current walls. So it's possible. Okay, this is the first question, the first answer. Speed of light? No, nope. it's the only the speed of light. So because there is no more than the speed of light. And the final question is from astronomy. Choose the right statement. Astronomy is the study of mind. Astronomy is the study of space. Or astronomy, astronomy, astronomy is the study of life. 
Tut, tut, tut. Well, the second. <laughs> okay, so I have one wrong answer. I need to play more physics games. And this is the exercise for today, and thanks for watching.